Hey y'all, I want to tell you about the latest updates or rather upgrades to the AMV Insight RT. Uh, as many of you know, the AMV system is the best live streaming system out there, especially for public safety. Uh, it's simple to use, it just works, and it works as it should, not a bunch of hoops to jump through. Uh, you plug and play, it's literally plug and play and one button press and you're up and running. The other thing is it's extremely low latency because actionable data is important, but it's a lot more important if they can make decisions on it now instead of 15 or 20 or two minute late information, right? So anyway, that's one thing that uh, AMV does and they do it right. The other thing, so today we have this paired. We have um, the AMV system paired with the Autel flight deck. Now. I want to do, I we've been testing the Autel Evo and some public safety scenarios. I hope to get some reviews out on that. And this is the flight deck. If for those of you who don't know what flight deck is, this is the answer to a request that we've been screaming about uh, for years now. And Autel answered the call. Uh, it's really a need. This operates completely separately from the controller. This would be the unit you set up at your command vehicle and it, re and it receives the stream directly from the aircraft. And I want to show you. I don't have the controller even turned on, so it's not a proximity thing. The pilot doesn't even have to have the controller turned on. It talks to the aircraft completely separately. So the pilot could be flying the drone a half a mile away, and the flight deck will pick up on the signal at command, and you'll get it at the same real time as the pilot gets it. And this thing does a fantastic job. It's the most impressive image I've seen. Again, hope to do a review on that and show you later. So let's get back to the AMV, though. Uh, so the updates that they did to the AMV Insight, uh, they did, or I should say upgrades again. So the, the couple things that they did is one of them, as most of you know by now that know about the AMV system, they did it right with the adjustments on the bit rate and the frame rate and that they put them in the hands of command because, again, actionable data. So the, the pilot doesn't need that information. He sees what he needs to see to fly but command does, and they're the ones that need to be able to adjust the stream. So they put it on the right end and they can control it. But one of the challenges was, well, what do we start off with? Give us a good, because we don't really know what K is. What is all this, this computer lingo? So they put in a bandwidth test that you can punch that real quick and it will come up and run a quick test. And the idea behind it is to give the user a good starting point. So there you go, now you know the speed. It gives you the speed, you can go back and set this accordingly. The next thing that they put on here was a record setup, which you see no USB device and you can set high and low, which kind of leads into what the other upgrade was. So law enforcement, as you may well understand, uh, if they're running an operation, let's say they have a warrant and they're gathering evidence or whatever, but they don't want to record that to the aircraft because that's confidential and sensitive information but they may need to record it. So AMV answered the call on that by adding the ability to record here at this unit and not on the aircraft itself. So this would be, this unit right here would be at command. And all I need to do to make this happen is pop a USB, let me get this, right, USB thumb drive into there. And then you'll quickly see that this says start record. So this is recording uh, and I don't know how well it show up, but you can see it also gives you indication of how much is left of that thumb drive. So if that gets low, you can grab another one and get it ready to swap them out. Now at the same time as that, I'm also streaming to my laptop over here. All right, so it's streaming and recording at the same time. And so I've recorded, I don't, I'm not gonna record a whole lot. This isn't really exciting. It's just my backyard and my storage shed. So I'm gonna hit stop, you'll see it finalize. As soon as it's done, I can remove the thumb drive. We can come over here and let me pop this into there real quick. All right. And so we're still streaming. And again, it's really nice stream like always. And this will pop open. Now it, it'll name these things something unique uh, based on your system. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and pop that open. And there you can see now, it's a very nice high quality stream, just like you'd expect it to be um, coming through their system. And you got it recorded locally. Nothing was saved on the drone itself. 
uh, and you have that capability now through AMV to do that local. So anyway, hopefully this was helpful. Uh, you know, again, uh, the combination of the AMV inside RT and this live deck, uh, unbelievable. You need to, if it's one of those things that you just have to kind of see for yourself, um, very nice upgrades to the AMV Insight and just wanted to kind of share them with you and hopefully this helps. Talk to you later. Bye.